16-year-old Mira Andreeva. <laughs> I think I got that right. We, ju we just got the correct pronunciation from the young lady herself. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, another straight set win today. You're now, by the way, inside the top 100 in the live rankings. So you said you wanted a bigger court. It wasn't one of the biggest courts, but, but what was it like for you playing today? It was a still a bigger court than I used to play, but I felt comfortable because it was not that much people, but still the crowd was cheering for her so much. Like it was just 10% for me and like 90 for her. So I just tried to stay focused and uh, focus on my game. And I think I managed to do it pretty well. I think you managed very well. You won that first set right out of the gate, 6-1. And you started out so well, especially on serve. You only lost two points on second serves. You did an incredible job from the start. What was the key to starting out so well? I didn't have any thoughts in my mind. I was just playing. I was just uh, doing my stuff, doing my thing. and. Uh, just enjoying, just uh, try to win uh, point after point, and that's it. I think I did it pretty well. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm curious because when we talk about you being so young and you know still gaining experience, obviously on the pro tour, just 16 years old. You've been moving up so quickly, playing so well, getting these big wins. It would seem like there isn't a lot of expectation on you because you're so young. But what are your expectations for yourself here at this tournament in particular? Honestly, I have no expectations. I just play and. Uh, if I can win, uh, if I can win a match, of course I'm happy because I'm happy after each win I have. So I just try to win, just try to win more points than my opponent. Uh, that's the key, by the way. So yes, but honestly, I have, I have no expectations. If I if I can win, of course I'm really happy. But if I lose, like I have nothing to lose. Yeah. So I just play. Uh, that's beautiful, and you've been doing that for five straight matches now here, at least. And, and by the way, on the pro circuit, 22 and two this year. So you're winning a lot more points than your opponents. Uh, Mira, you've talked about meeting some beautiful faces, and of course, uh, meeting some heroes. Whether whether it was Ange Burr, somebody you really wanted to meet, Coco Gauff, Francis Tiafoe. Who else have you not met that you would like to meet? Um. Honestly, I think I've met almost everybody because I've been uh, here last year and I saw a lot of faces also because it was like second week and so like almost all the the top five were here. So I saw everybody, but I just want to mention that Andrei Rublev is so nice. I, I, know, I think everybody knows that he is like one of the kindest players on tour, but um, honestly, Kachanov, Rublev, uh, and all like the Russian players, they're so nice to me. I don't know why. So, yes, I just wanted to mention that uh, Rublev and Kachanov, they say hi to me first. <laughs> and I don't even have to say hi first by myself. They just say hi. And I'm like, hi. And so I'm always so happy when they say hi. So, yes. Well, we've talked about you <laughs> looking to practice, maybe with Ans Jabur, among some other players. Have you ever uh, looked at or thought about playing mixed doubles? Do you play a little doubles? Would you like to play mixed doubles? And who would you like to play? Who, who would be your first choice of a mixed doubles partner? Mixed doubles. It's a good question, by the way. I would like to play with everybody because <laughs> <laughs> everybody is so good. I mean, I, of course, I think I would feel more comfortable playing with uh, uh, maybe Rublev okay. because uh, he's kind. I'm also kind of nice. And I think it uh, could be a good uh, mixed doubles. Yeah, he's good. He's got an Olympic medal too. That'd be yes, a good partner. Yes, we <laughs> we cannot forget that. Uh, so if maybe one day he will propose me, of course I will not say no. I will just say yes and yes and yes. Okay, you may have to ask Nastia to <laughs> get her permission if you can play with Rublev. Well, congratulations once again. Another wonderful performance today. Keep it up. And we hope to see you again soon. Thank you. Thank you.